It's beer o'clock on Real Old Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Rigel Beer Manufacturer and it's a bottle of the Noctus 100. I've just had a little look at the ingredients on the back of here. First of all, it's 10% ABV. It's been brewed with pale chocolate and dark chocolate malt and Munich malt. Uh, it was kindly sent to us by beerdeluxe.de check them out beerdeluxe.de they've got a wonderful array of German craft beer plus American craft beer there's a look at the bottle cap let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get now the owner or um, Michael who works for beerdeluxe.de really wanted me to try this one so um, I really brought it forward to um, get it reviewed for him he really likes it Nice bit of smoke on the opening. Oh my goodness me. Look at the glug. Oh my, look at that. That just looks, it looks like a Russian Imperial Stout or an Imperial Porter. That looks so dense and thick and chocolatey. It's jet black. You're not getting any light through that beer whatsoever. It's a two finger tan colored head, a deep tan color. And wow, it's really got my kind of mouth water in this beer. Got to get the aroma on this 10% beer. Oh, blimey. German yeast. Fruity, dry yeast. Smells a little bit like a dunkel. Smells a lot like a dunkel. But with chocolate malt, with roasted malt. <sighs> Gotta try this one. Let's dive in. Cheers. Wow. Blooming heck. As they say up north in the UK. Blooming heck. Stone the crows. Uh, where do I start with this one? I think I'm going to start with the mouthfeel. The mouthfeel is so dense and thick and creamy. It's just mesmerising. It's got to be, there's got to be oats in this beer to get that kind of thickness up. There's got to be a lot of kind of malt used to get that thick, thick like wort. Uh, gloopy mouthfeel. It's nicely carbonated, springs around the inside of the mouth. And then there's just this fruity bomb that explodes in your mouth. Like... It's a, I'm going to say, it's a, it, for me, it's a dunkel. Uh, a lot of it is dunkel. That Wenstefana beer that I reviewed, the Vitas, it tastes a lot like the Wenstefana Vitas, but then it's got an extraordinary chocolate malt kick and bitterness on the back end. It's a cross between Wenstefana Vitas and some amazing kind of Norwegian or Swedish Russian Imperial Stout. Let me rock the beer back and forth. I'm going to show you the quality of that beer. It's dense, it's fruity. Oh, it's brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant beer. Um, I'm trying to get control. When, when, I, when I taste a really good beer, I just want to stand here in complete silence and drink it. But I'm having to kind of think and talk and, and, and pull all of these different flavours out. And it's very difficult, as I just mentioned, when you get an amazing beer like this. It's more difficult than you think to do. Um, because you just, you just simply can't concentrate. Dense, it's fruity, chocolatey, a little bit of coffee in there. 
the bitterness on the back end is amazing. Fantastic mouthfeel, lovely carbonation. This, for me, and this is a big, bold statement. This is probably the best beer I have ever drank from Germany. And that's a bold one. Just look at the quality of the head developing in the glass. Look at the beer. There's no English. Unfortunately, there's no English for me to read. Um, but guys, Noctus 100 from Richard Beer Manufacturer, you have to, you ha simply have to try this beer. If you're a beer lover, If you like your German beer, if you like your German kind of doppelbox, that's what I'm looking for, doppelbox. If you like your German doppelbox, Dunkel style beers with a fruitiness, if you like your Russian Imperial Stouts, if you think them two beers would be amazing mixed, then you have to try this. It's really good. You can get it from beerdeluxe.de. Rating for me then. <coughs> There's only one mark I'm going to give this beer. It's a 10 out of 10. It's a 10 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. An absolutely devastatingly fantastic beer. Thanks for watching. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer reviews and cheers.